Okay, so here we have two components that make up my uh, DIY shoulder brace and it's a Manfrotto type 361 or model 361 uh, shoulder brace and this is designed as an attachment that goes on a monopod. You can see that it, it has a flexible joint here and that this rotates, the base of it rotates. Okay, so when you attach the camera to it, the camera will rotate and I'll show you how that works in a minute. Also this is telescoping. You'll, uh, I'm holding the camcorder with one hand so I won't have much success trying to extend it but you'll see that it extends out this length here another six inches approximately. This also swivels and it stows away like that into its handle. Here's the, uh, let's see, it's a B-A-R-S-K-A AccuGrip, Barska AccuGrip a handheld tripod they call it on on amazon.com that goes for around fifteen dollars and the Manfredo 361 which is this unit goes for around let's see thirty four dollars so altogether forty fifty bucks this weighs almost nothing I gotta say it probably weighs probably six ounces four five six ounces this weighs even less maybe three ounces so what happens is I've added a uh, three-eighths to quarter-inch adapter because this comes with a quarter-inch standard quarter-20 thread and unfortunately this comes with a three-eighths type thread in the, in the brass insert here. So to get these two together you have to have a three-eighths to quarter-inch adapter threaded on there. Then you thread that into here, into the bottom like this Oops. trying to do this one handed is a lot of fun and now what you have is a poor guy's steadying device okay I don't know if anybody else has thought this up but if they have uh, it's a pretty good idea um, you can see that it swivels and it also articulates up and down and this also swivels. This gives you a lot of freedom of movement while maintaining a uh, very steady shot. I'll give you some examples of what that looks like in, a, in a, another clip or I'll, I'll uh, edit that clip to this one. Okay, let, I'm going to go ahead and put it on the camera and I'll show you what kind of shots you can get with it. Okay, so I'm just going to kind of walk around the uh, upstairs room here and uh, there's my soldering table now uh, keeping it tucked into my arm I can do this kind of a shot because it's got the, the swivel joint you get kind of a boom up boom down kind of a shot while maintaining the level of the camera you can also swivel the camera up and down just by moving the handle and you can also go left to right Okay, let's see what other kind of shots we can get with this thing. There's my uh, little gadget table that I build stuff on. And let's see, I'm just kind of swiveling my whole body. That's kind of a typical shot you can get with a shoulder brace. But here's one that you probably can't get with most of them. You lock on this item and swivel left or right and you get kind of a almost like a mini dolly move out of it. That's pretty cool. You get the boom up, boom down. There's not much light over there, so let me go over here. You get a boom up, and you can go real slow, boom down. Get a kind of a perspective change. You can go left while maintaining uh, your shot and you know what you're shooting in the middle. You can go right while doing the same, so you get kind of a mini dolly move out of it and so it's braced up against your shoulder or you can stick it in the right now I've moved it to the middle of my chest and I've got both hands on the handle uh, handle grip pistol grip and so here is the same shot so let's walk around with this just a little bit there's a little kitchen in my upstairs so you can get kind of a very steady I'm swiveling my body around I'm getting a very uh, quick pan here. Let's go back again. 
real slow shot and I'm booming up booming down some charging equipment kind of walk around let me walk left to right while keeping the camera track to the center of what I'm shooting so you get kind of a dolly move type operation out of it and it's still pretty steady because it's steadied up against my chest anyway I thought y'all would like to see this uh, I've had it for a while I entertained the thought of maybe putting them together and selling them on eBay but really they're just so easy to build that anybody once they saw it they just figure it out real quick and uh, I'd be all done with that anyway all the parts are available at amazon.com and uh, so have fun with that and don't forget to get your uh, 3 8 to quarter inch adapter.